Okay, I'm uh, gonna go in for Blitz Hour. Not feeling too sharp, but hey, what can you do? Let's just go in and see what happens. Let's push in the center here, so free and all. Oops. Slippage. Yeah, good. Let's go here. A bit slow, a bit slow. Like I said, I'm not feeling too sharp, so I'm trying to giddy myself up. It's not very often you see this pawn push, is it? Oof. Wow. Not very often you see that. Let's go here. That might have been a mistake, you know? I think it was a mistake, but we'll bring the bishop back. I was trying to make space for the knight coming here. Told you I'm not with it really. I'm going to take. Oh, I'm giving the knight the permission to come off. Oh, I'm crying out loud. Let's go here. Try and protect the pawn. Try and get castle. Queen's coming there, putting three pieces on there now. So we're just going to get hit all over the place. Oh. Oh, dear me. I said I wasn't feeling good. I'm on the strongest site in the world. Don't know if they've taken advantage of it or not. Let me see. Probably doesn't make any difference, does it? No, it that probably doesn't. Try and get the bishop out. And they're still not taking advantage of hitting this loads of times. So I'm going to take. Hopefully they take with the queen, we take with the knight. Please, come on. I know it looks so obvious, but... Oh, what we're doing here? What we're doing? Just bring the queen here. Just trying to give my king some company. Just keep the company coming as best possible. I've got nothing. Don't really feel like I've got anything. Knight attacking the queen. Queen's coming round, doing a double dose. Oh, he's attacking this pawn as well. Oh my gosh. A little bit too good for me. I need to wake up, sharpen up, do something. And what's going on here? Get the bishop. I'm hoping I'm getting them panicking now. Oh, no. oh get the queen. Oh, thanks. He's come for the rook with the bishop. Doesn't mean we've won anything. He's got the bit. He's taken the knight. Rook, sorry. He's taken. Okay, let's come back and attack their knight. Let's not get in a flap now then. Try and keep it as safe as possible. Got them thinking. <clears throat> uh, are we attacking anything? No, no, no. Bring the bishop out, attacking his rook, attacking the bishop. Take the bishop. Got the pawn. Not taking the pawn, push onto the knight. Knight's coming in for the queen, he's coming for some compensation. Do we move the queen here? Oh, we're gonna lose out, aren't we? He's got two on here. Bishop's here. I'm gonna do knight, can, can the knight do something? Anything? Come on, get this pawn pushed up. Does take, and shall we just go for a knight move? Let's go with a knight move. Can't go here, because his knight's there. Um, can go, can't go here, can't go here. Oh, what are we doing? Bishop, bishop, bishop. Knight, pawn. Just Oh, shit. I don't believe what I've just done. Just giving the knight up. Oh, well, we're going to get a rook. Oh, dear me. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Shocking, shocking, shocking. He's hunting down my queen. I can see him, but his knight's not got anything on there. So we'll get a rook. Uh, take this one in the corner and get the queen out somewhere near to the king. Surely that's got to be half decent. There's nothing, I ain't got anything meaty ever. And take this pawn two on one. Getting closer to the king. Still no mate type situation. And check on the king. Knight's not coming here. Bishop, Rook. Uh, has he got a fork? It's attacking the pawn, isn't he? Let's go here. Don't lose on time, dude. Shall we hit the knight? He's moving that knight confidently. 
uh, it's coming from a king, queen, thing, blah, blah. Let's attack this, uh, this knight. Is he hitting our queen? No, let's take the knight. Let's bring the rook into the game a little bit. Let's bring the knight here, attacking the knight. That was sketchy, still sketchy. Let's go here. So I take the knight with a check. Cool. Oof. Ugly. Ugly, ugly, ugly. I was going to say the ugliest chess game I've played, but no, there's some previous ones that were uglier. Oh my gosh. I told you I wasn't feeling, feeling sharp at all. That was a terrible opening. I won't even do an analysis on that because we were getting creamed. Yeah, uh, well maybe we do. Let's do an analysis. It's going to have to be a self-analysis, isn't it? Never can find it. Let's just on this. Wait, why? Is it game review? But I don't. I only get one game review. Oh, never mind. Seventy-nine. I want to just do an analysis, but it's saying Opening just the king's pawn oh, control center, center, center and opens, opens up the up light squared bishop, bishop and queen. queen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I don't want game. any of that rubbish. No, let me do my own analysis. Where, where is it? I come out of this. It must be. Where is it? Oh, uh, this this that's really... Oh God, it's that. Oh, actually, no, it's just showing that. Ooh. Okay, just going backwards. <laughs> Let's just. Yeah, that was just absolutely terrible. Yeah, that pawn pushed through me. Maybe I just didn't do that right. Maybe I didn't react to that right. What do we do? What do we do? Because I wanted to. Hmm. Make space for the night to come here but that really wasn't the case I shouldn't have done that I'm sure it's the bishop move or are we just attacking the pawn yeah I think it's attacking the pawn it's more simple yeah we're attacking the pawn so if he pushes then we can go da 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 yeah I've got too arty there smallest of details yeah, I'm just really looking at the start of that. It was that pawn push because I, I don't don't usually see the pawn push down, but I've given them the advantage by bringing the bishop out. All I had to do was hit the pawn. Right, okay, we'll go on to our next one. As you can see, we're not warmed at all in any way, shape. Let's just come here. It's three and O. Oh. Okay, let's try and stop the Bianchetto bishop. Let's get the bishop out. This looks pretty tame, let's bring here, which means we're going to be probably in trouble. I'm not going to bring it down here to here because it's got like a stonewall effect going on with the pawns. It's castle. So I'm going to bring my knight around so then we can start, well I think I'm going to be attacking these pawns. So doing lazy man's chest, but it can be effective, yeah, which they're just carrying on doing that maneuver shouldn't really leave it there gonna take and then going to bring the bishop here bishop takes knight takes sorry let's go here knight takes queens on the rook rook goes back oh it doesn't damn goes greedy munching Oh, that's interesting. Let's go here. A forward moving knight, but attacking backwards. Has he got a small piece to attack our queen? That's what they're probably thinking now. So the rook comes here or there or there or there or goes down. Oh, it's getting taken. Yeah, so he's attacking our queen. 
So I'm going to bring the queen here, I'm attacking their queen. We're still on their rook, so he's got to safety, which is not fair really. We did all that nice work. So I'm going to take and be on the knight. I'm hoping we've won a bit of tempo, but it's it's blitz and my brain is a little bit fuzzy trying to warm it up oh what is this now so we can take the queen and get the knight it's got to check on get the knight but it doesn't give us anything there plus three and it's even stevens and it's ugly i thought we had some sort of advantage with that exchange then um let's bring the rook here just thinking too much now yeah, I thought we had something there. I thought we had like um, a bit of material extra on top. Let's go here. But it's not looking that way. At all. Um, knight, knight, attacking the pawn. Coming back around, attacking the rook. I'll just go attack a pawn. Looking for a checkmate. Ouch. Damn, that was a bit lucky. Lucky, lucky, lucky. My gosh. Hmm. So just to do the analysis, you just go backwards. <laughs> right, let's quick shifty at that. Again, another ugly game. Not with it whatsoever. I'm just wanting to look at the small detail. Maybe allowing the pawn coming pushing down. I didn't think it was too major because it didn't look like he had any other pieces supporting it but you have to be very mindful because if it does sit there and then somehow the queen comes and squishes it and they do have the nice diagonal of the bishop but we've got that currently blocked off but we do capture so yeah they are winning oh they're winning even more with that so that was not a very good maneuver I had this lovely picture in my head thinking yes we're, we're winning something but we're not winning a damn thing oh it's a bishop he took I thought it was a pawn he took. <laughs> That's why. Oh. Yeah, that's why. I thought I had more material. You know, with the exchanges that I thought we were to take um, going through in the later part of the game, just after this. I mean, I, I thought that was a pawn he took, but it was a bishop. Yeah, so when all this started kicking off here, I'm thinking, oh yeah, yeah, we've won material, but it, it was even. Oh my gosh, that shows you how bad my brain is today, thinking the bishop's a pawn. Oh. But we got lucky, and we got the checkmate. We'll play another one. Uh, we said we're doing for about an hour, and that was a long time playing Blitz, isn't it? Maybe we might do a shortened version. Let's just uh, kick in here and see what we've got. Oh, we've got the big guns in now. Got the big guns. Let's go here. Shall we bring the knight up? Don't think too much. Just take and bring the knight up. Shall we just push this pawn a little bit? Bring the bishop here. Let's get the bishop. Just blocking the queen. It's castle. Not sure we're going to be hitting the bishop because he's just going to take it, I think. Because he wants to be in front of our king. So I'm actually going to... Oh, I'm not doing that. I'll do it this way. Right. Takes... Oh, oh, I could have just taken there, but never mind. And let's go here, keeping space for the queen to come in. And they're dancing around. Let's hit the queen because... Oh, excuse me. Because we've got support from the knight currently. So we're giving them things to think about. We can't go here, but we can go here. See if there's any targeting towards this king. Let's bring the rook opposite there, rook. Let's go for the bishop. Shall we take and attack the queen? Go for the pawn because it's green. Oh, no, he's not. Okay. And knight can do many things. Let's go here, not there. And shall we push? Probably pushing past. Yep, let's hit, open up some space in front of the king, get a check on from the rook, bring the rook here. So we want to try and get the ownership of this file, so he's protecting the rook. 
with the knight. It's going to bring the rook here, attacking the knight. Looking to try and double the rooks if we can. And he's got bigger fish to fry, I see. Okay, so we'll bring this rook here. I think he's bringing that rook back. And we'll go with the check on the king and we'll take with the check on the king. Bring the rook down, attacking this pot. Oh, I've been in a position like this before and I messed it up. Oh, I have, yeah. I've been in a very similar position to this and I messed it up. And it looks like I'm doing the same thing again. Looks like, oh, look at that, yeah. Oh, man. Totally messing it up. Got space now. Oh, what am I doing? Push. Damn, that was a mouse slip. Now he can take the pawn with the knight and he's going to have a 2 on 1. He's not doing that just yet, so I'm going to move the king here because he could have taken there. Oh, this is not good. Let's go here. Got all these pawns he's got on the side and he's got a minute to play with as well. Oh, shabby. Oh, that knight is just going to stay there forever, isn't it? What am I doing? Go here. It's gotta start pushing them pawns. Yeah, the knight's staying there. Can't, I can't get that knight off. Round, round. What's he think he's doing? Coming for the pawn. Oh. Well, wow, that's gonna hurt, isn't it? Yeah, what can I do? Knight's gonna get taken. I think I might resign this one because this is going to be very painful. I don't think there's any ways of me getting out of this. At all. No. Knight can't take on three pawns. And the king. I can't even take because the rook's just going to take. What's he doing? It's hitting my rook. Oh, hurt me. <laughs> oh my god. I do not know what I'm doing at all. In any way, shape, any forks, anywhere. No, there's nothing. I've got zilch. Zilch. Still playing on. It's still playing on. Oh, it's all over. Okay, let's resign, 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 resign. It had to happen sooner or later. Totally messed it up. Let's jump on to another one. I've not actually looked at my timestamp yet. One second. God, it's only 18 minutes. Wow, we're going to have to go through some serious pain. Let's go here. Let's attack the pot. Get the knight out. Probably don't move so urgently. Let's attack this pawn. Attack the queen. Support the knight. Oh, if you... God! Damn it! Oh! Oh, that's gonna sting. That's gonna sting. Oh. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. It's not gonna make any difference. We're still gonna be down a minor piece. Oh, shocking, shocking, shocking. What's he deliberating at? Bishop takes, we get the bishop. Okay, fair enough. Let's take. Two nineteen times not on our side. Bishop, what is he doing? Go we'll check on. We could just squeeze there. We can attack the queen. To 
take the queen. Oh, that would be nice. In fact, it is nice. Oh no, the knight's there. Ooh, dear me. The knight is there. What we're gonna do? Stop this knight from jumping down. Slow it down. Bring the bishop here. Maybe shouldn't have brought the bishop there. Let's bring it here. Attack the knight. Attack the knight. Double the rooks. We can. Let's double. Oh man, this is gonna hurt. Oh, fork. One thirty-seven. Oh, come on with the skills. Knights jumping down with a check. Uh, he's not doing that, but he could be doing it anytime soon. But do we just move the king back? Oh, what's with that overthinking? It's protecting that area, isn't he? Get the white square bishop in. Let's take this off the board. So, getting on my nerves. Fitting the rook. Good go here. Is stopping the bishop from getting in the game a little bit, and we've got to be careful, dudes. We've got to be because we can't go here, we can't go there, we can't go here. There's a lot we can't do, isn't there? Let's go here with the knight. We take this off the board, let's bring the knight in. Looking to trade time wise, it's not it's not on our side. Oh yeah, gotta be joking me, man. Over here. So they're just doing annoying moves now because my time's running out. They could castle still, couldn't they? And take. Waiting for the bishop to move. Go here. It's not a checkmate, but does move. Get the rook off the board. Put a check. Oh, uh, we don't. We could, uh, but we're gonna lose the damn. Okay, lose the knight. It's got a check on me. Dark square bishop. Uh, let's move here. White square. Push. Remote. Check. What is happening? It's doing annoying moves. Space here. doing annoying moves excuse me because I'm down on time oh damn oh Oh, I hate chess. 24 minutes. That's like nearly half an hour. Maybe that's enough for doing blitzy type stuff, do you think? I think so. 
playing an hour is a long time i think i've done a recent hour long one and, and that was a killer jumping all over the place and let's have a look we'll go for one more and it's only going to be a half hour half hour session but you never know i might stay on i might be warming up or i may be tilting down let's attack the palm definitely got to move faster let's take let's take take attack let's take the knight off the board get the bishop out get the knight out knight out let's castle queen side and let's attack the pawn and is there let's push this pawn probably get the knight to the other side it's got a dark square bishop let's push i don't think we'll get onto the white square oh we will do okay let's do that and he's moving confidently so we need to start moving this knight i think and move the knight to the other side of the board get it here Attack the bishop. Nice spot here. And we can take. Let's take. Trade, trade, trade. Let's hit the rook. Take. Let's take the bishop off the board. Although, I do like my knight. I do like my knight. Let's push this pawn. Let's just bring this here. See what's going to. He wants us to take that bishop. Now we've got a rubbish bishop really here, haven't we? So we're going to have to start doing the king moves. Ah, so he's bringing his bishop into life. So if we can squeeze our king here, maybe. King's protecting, so the knight's going to be jumping. King, sorry, bishop's going to be moving. Knight's looking to protect the pawn. Let's attack the knight. He'll get some compensation somewhere, will he? Yeah, he's got the check. Yeah, some compensation here. Here. And let's push. Fake. It's coming for our pawn. Bishop can protect. It's got another pawn that can protect if he's pushing past. And I think we can start moving the pawn up. Excuse me. Can't go here, can't go there. Our king can't go to this square. So we can come here. Maybe attack these pawns. Got to be a bit swift about it. We've got them in the big thing. Good time wise, then <clears throat> we don't need to panic so much. Excellent. We'll crack on with some free O on the other side. Anonymous, the casual chess player. Let's crack on. So, we're going to look at maybe a half hour on this side of things. We've done half hour on the other side. Let's see what we can do here. This is a strange looking opening that I'm throwing myself into. I don't play like this. Oh my giddy, I thought I'd warmed up. Castle. Uh, this looks odd. Sh shall we? Go here. 
Now where am I getting my knight? Are they, are they gonna allow my knight to sit it? No, they're not. Let's take. Let's attack their knight. Got them thinking for a brief moment. That's good. Keep thinking. Keep thinking. Keep. Oh, do we take this knight or not? We like hitting this pawn. Head of the snake. Well, there's no snake, but yeah. Let's take and let's take. Stuck in the bish. Mistake to take type thing. I don't know. Let's go with this. Take. Pawn's got no protection, stacking our queen. Let's hide the queen. Very strange looking opening I've put myself into here. Good take. Just give them something. Let's push the pawn. Let's put a check on the king. Let's bring the rook here, attacking the bishop. Trying to own the file, but he's got a lot of armor in there. Ooh, okay. Let's take. Let's take with the queen. And let's hit the. Ooh, we've got to be careful. Got to be careful. Got a two on one here. We bring the bishop here. His rook's going to come here, and then we can't take the bishop. Oh, he's got a two on one. So shall we go like this for now? And then move the queen here. Because we've still got the two on one protection. Very clever. Looking to sit the bishop here. Bring the bishop here, attacking the rook. Stopping the queen from having the two on one. And now we can move the queen away from here, can't we? What do we do? I'm going to double the pawns. Because um, I don't really know what is happening uh, oh attack the rook simple 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 take oh we're giving them a damn pawn <clears throat> we've given them a pawn and he's going to come down put a check on the king and he's going to come for this pawn here but the bishop's currently protecting So it's even Stevens, but I am not a fan of this position whatsoever. Going a white square with the pawn. But, ooh, that might be interesting. X-ray through. Got no protection. Okay, does have protection now. Let's put this on a white square. We're running out of time. I'm going to take. We. Let's just go here. It's going to come down and attack. But let's take. And can't protect all these pawns. Oh, that's not good. I'd have to sit my rook here, but he's going to beat us to the punch. And he'd get that. So I'd have to move my king. He's letting us take. Let's attack. He defends in the rook. 45 seconds. Not good, not good. Attack the pawn. Takes. Put a check on the king. Maybe not then. Let's go here. Oh, I'm not a fan of this. We'll push. He takes, takes. No, that don't look good, does it? Ooh. Well, 28 seconds. It's not going to end well for me, is it? Let's go here. Did I move? No. Let's go. He's attacking the king. He's not attacking the king. Let's go down. Oh, he's attacking the king now. No, he's not. Okay, let's attack the rook. And that was wrong because I'm going to get zugs wanged. This king's just coming here, blocking everything off. Go here. And I don't know if he's done that right. Let's go here. Let's take. Let's move the king. Push. I've only got 10 seconds. I'm not going to get anything in 10 seconds, am I?
<laughs> oh, draw. <laughs> okay, well, that was <laughs> that was that strange opening. I don't know what why I put myself in that strange opening. But anyway, then we came back and we fought back and stuff like that. So that's good. Good practice. So we'll go on to the next one. And look up, let me look at my timestamp, Aruni. Yep. Okay, so we've got 24 minutes left to go. Let's jump in. Let's push. And get the night up. Shit. Take, take the pawn, take the pawn, take the knight, oh, too frantic dude, too frantic, he's got to check on my king, no he's not doing that, let's take it in, check on the king now, no, okay, they've let us get away with daylight robbery there, oh, protecting the damn pawn, I could have taken that with a check. On the king as well. And double. Where is it? Oh, his knight's coming here. Knight's coming there. Knight is coming there. He's attacking the pawn. Let's go here. I should have done something about that earlier. Now it's... um. Bit messed up for us. Gotta check on the king. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. let's bring the rook here. Bring the queen here. That might be. Oh, that might be a strange looking situation. Let's go here. Mm. Let's come back. Go here. Ah, he's not going for a draw. Don't want to draw. Doesn't want to draw. Not happy with a draw. King. Push. Push. So they do this first to mess this up, don't they? It's not good, it's not good. Maybe be seeing this pawn, it's going to be pushing it down. Mm-hmm. King's coming over now, stopping all of the shenanigans. He's going to get a 2 on one there. to do okay do this maybe I should have gone there actually because now he's gonna be saving his pawn maybe not oh it's a draw anyway what am I on about what did he resign for it's a draw that's a draw any because no matter what I do because he can just go back like that I take and he just stays in that damn corner doesn't he you know he can go up and down come across so it's a draw even the computer is showing it's a draw but hey if you don't know that type of um, ending then you win a drawn game nice one okay do 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 we have 
20 minutes left am I not allowed to take a break I'm not professional you know let's go let's go let's go let's go 3-0 let's push through let's see what we've got um, push this one get the white square bishop out Always for the people. Get the queen supporting, but then there's all this happening. Oh yes, it's all this happening. Bad combination. Oh shit! <laughs> he didn't take my queen. He moved too quick. Oh, thankfully they didn't take the queen. Oh, crikey! That was bad. That was bad. Bit of narration mode there. They're just going crazy, aren't they, with the speed? And I've lost the thread now. I'm trying to get my mind back into the game. It's not really here. Let's bring this bishop here. Let's take. Maybe I shouldn't have done that either. Oh, There's a lot of maybe shouldn't have in this game. Let's attack the rook. Just comes here and attacks it. I'll bring it back again. So I'm doing like total non-moves, not really giving me any benefit whatsoever, my team's not working together, I'm not happy with the position. There I said it, I'm not happy with this position at all. You can tell when I'm happy with the positions that I start flowing. This one, I'm floundering all over the place. Luckily they're going into a long thing but I don't really see why they are. So we're just going to have to bring it back or even to here because it's going to be pushing anyway. Yep, oh, he's not dropped there, but um, what we got? We look to try and double here. I don't know. He's just protecting the pawn, right? He's moving quick again. Knight needs to get in the game. Come on, what are you doing? Thinking something like this or something, but maybe he's got too many pieces on there. Or is it this then? Not really attacking anything there. Comes here. No. I don't know. They're being very cool. Taking the time, the long pause. So when you play Blitz, you think you're playing a quick game, but then these long pauses can really mess it up. So I'm going to bring the bishop here rather than here. Kind of kind of trying to bait it. Don't know if it's going to work or not. This rook doesn't have any protection on. A long pause. What are the, what's the danger saying? Danger zones. I can't really see any for the opponent either, but I'm not happy with my position, so I'm hoping they make a mistake of some sort that gives us, you know, if they push here, then is it an advantage us taking? They take, they take, or is it just going to push the pawn? The time is running out though, there's no increment on this. It looks like they've given up. Yeah, didn't like that opening whatsoever. That was not good. Just a quick look at the old analysis type thing to see how bad it was. Yeah, look at that. That's no good. That's no good. Wasn't happy with that whatsoever. Boom, boom. Yeah, from the start. Look at it. Ugh. Yeah. Some ugly chess today. All right, nice one. Let me look at my timestamp. Oh, 15 minutes left. That's going quick, isn't it? This hour. 
Right, let's go and play another one. Let's do the old creation and boom. Right, three and oh. Playing as black, let's push in the center here. Oh, we've got a thinker. Um, let's bring the knight out. Not very often you see this side. We have a strange move. Just going to get castled and get away from strange play. Let's go here. Obviously looking to attack this here. Might get the knight out first. Don't know. We shall see. We're attacking the pawn, so we may as well bring this pawn here. And attack their bishop. They forget themselves, but they've put it there for a reason. It does give space for the queen to come here if there's any sort of castling type stuff. Not that that's anything major. Ooh, knight could come here as well. So I'm going to bring the queen here and see if the knight can sit here and see if we can get rid of this knight and then go for a checkmate of some sort. Obviously that's not going to happen that way, but it's nice to dream. Probably going to end up getting trapped because the knight's going to attack the queen. Spoiling the party. Okay, is that a convoluted way of trapping the queen? We bring the knight up here, the bishop takes, but the knight is still protecting this damn square, so we're not going to get much joy out of that. I'm going to bring the knight up, supporting the knight. So I'm glad they're putting a lot of thought in in this short game, free and oh. So let the, let the seconds run out, time management is key. But I'm always very mindful of the long pause players who can find the right moves. They take a long time making the move, but they make the right moves. So it doesn't really matter that their time is running out because they find those good moves. Sometimes, not all of the time, but when they do, so like the knight's coming here now it's moved away from that spot which is the spot we want which is to come here to put pressure on this pawn i think they'll probably just come back to protect the pawn because i can't see anything else being able to defend that pawn other than the knight coming back again and if they go back we can just take the bishop off the board if the knight They've realized it, but they've taken with their queen. And they're on our rook. What am I missing here? Let's attack the bishop. Okay, they didn't want to bring the knight back then and defend the pawn. So I don't think this is one of those long long pauses that finds the better position. If we take knight takes, got to check on the king. So we can hit the knight. Knight, oh look at the position. Look at that. <laughs> hit the knight and he gets a fork on our queen. So I don't think we want to play them apples, do we? I could just move the queen here and attack a pawn. Take it out of the equation. Knight's attacking, so again, taking it out of the equation. Does it have a safe spot? Yes, because if the rook attacks it, it can take another pawn and try and get itself to safety if need be. Could even sit here. The knight's coming in, looking to get a rook off the board. Yep, so we could move the rook because we don't want to take any damage. So let's just move the rook and defend the pawn. Wow, that's definitely that was warm potatoes for me nice bit of 
yeah, that was okay. Okay, I mean, they understand. I, I believe they understood what they needed to do, which was protect that pawn there. But somehow they just got carried away with moving the knight and bringing the bishop down here. Anyway, crazy times. So we have nine minutes left. We're going to make it through to the end. Let's click on this. I don't need to do analysis on that one. And let's just push through and block. Let's bring the knight up, supporting the pawn. And as we do, just stop in the fried liver, get the knight out. Castle. Let's open up the white square bishop. This is where the knight's going to be just sinking in here. Yep, so they are. I'm going to attack the bishop, see what it's wanting to do. Hit the knight, see what it's wanting to do. And I've got a problem now because I've trapped my own knight. Oh, and they've not seen it. So we can move this pawn, maybe move it up here. And then we can escape. Because our knight would have been trapped if they pushed the pawn down here. We had nowhere to go. These small details. They probably sat kicking themselves now. So he's tacking the knight. Let's just bring the knight out of the way. They're going for the long pause thing now. So I think we have to be careful now. It's even Stevens at the minute. They're looking for those good moves. Better moves. Can we block them off? Not really tempting to go here. So I think what I'm going to do is go opposite there, queen. I know there's pieces in this, but you know, if it kicks off, it can work and be a benefit to you. And hit this palm, end of the snake. Let's take, shall we take, or shall we take with this palm? Take with this pawn, the rook is more opposite the king, queen, as we mentioned. Does have this pawn here with his knight. So probably should have taken with the knight because now we're giving a pawn up. We are attacking their bishop. There's a lot of things happening at the moment. But I think that taking there gives them a nice position on the board. We'll just take the bishop if he does that anyway for now. Yeah, so I should have probably left the pawn there but i still quite like the idea of being opposite here but we are taking a bit of damage so we'll look at the analysis on this one afterwards we're probably going to get told off for actually taking on this side with the pawn because we're losing a pawn here so that gives them plus one we take the bishop rook takes and we can look to press onto the pawn but you can just push down at some point probably would get the pawn back but I wouldn't be chomping at the bit to get the pawn back do I have a better position on the board I don't know looks like I'm struggling but their time is running out because they're overthinking which is good for us So from the start of this session, I mean, <laughs> we started to warm up a little bit, but then even when warmed up, still making kind of little bits of errors. Although for me, I'm feeling happy with it. It's just, I'm thinking, well, I'm giving them a pawn here and how would it have played out type thing? Let's just have a look. Yeah, so it's a plus one or then 1.5. Yeah, so we're saying they're going to just take the pawn here. Then we're going to take the bishop. Rook takes. Yeah, okay. If the rook takes, there's a problem. Interesting. There's a problem because that knight doesn't have any protection on it. So that might have worked for us. Yeah, so if they took, we were going to take the bishop. So that's no... That was what we were doing. But it's for them not to take. 
and it's basically saying move the knight out of the way and it's saying knight c6 which is attacking the rook oh excuse me knight c6 yeah knight c6 attacking the rook and the queen so it's getting a rook as well oh wow so if they had played it that way that's the type of thing I was umming and ahhing about, wasn't it? Does it improve my position? I'm not too sure. Giving them that extra pawn. I mean, basically, it is a knight. It can go anywhere. Yeah, but the hum more human thing would have been to actually take, in a quick game, would have been the rook taking the bishop. And that would have given us an advantage because the knight didn't have any protection. But this is a nice move here. So if they had done something like that, I would have been crying in my soup. I'd be, oh, well, you know, what can I do? So if I came here to defend the bishop, is that not any good? I mean, it's saying queen e6. Oh, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> queen e6. So if I come here to protect the bishop, the knight takes the rook. Rook takes. And we're on there like that. We still have the options of this, but he can always push. And it's plus three for them. So, yeah. Yeah. I would have still been able to play with that. It would have been a bit of heartache and play pain. But I, was, I still would have had motion in the game. Got to be careful with the movements I'm making. You know. The pawn taking was not the right thing. So let's have, just have a look again. As we said, we're going to have a look at that. So taking with the knight, I think, yeah, it's saying knight, knight taking. Yeah, I was looking at the gold. I was looking at the x-ray through to the queen. It's not showing it's that bad. It's plus one at the minute. But then we do take. Yeah, so what did they do next? So they took. And that's where we come into the what we should do next really so we shouldn't really take the bishop it's saying rook c8 rook a c8 so moving this rook to stop the knight from jumping into the glorious square because the bishop's nicely protected so we don't really need to do anything right okay bear that in mind got a little bit too arty for myself with that pawn just take with the knight Keep it nice and simple. Okay, good stuff. And we've got two minutes left and I'm leaving it on that one because we've done a full hour and we didn't think we were going to make the full hour. We thought we were just going to do the first half hour because it was like a little bit shabby. It got a little bit better in the second half and then it went a bit shabby again. But it's all good. Good practice. <laughs> 